Good afternoon, Mrs. Thompson. Would you mind joining me? Come on back. Well, I'm glad you took the time and went through the sleep study that uh, you took home with you. I think it was uh, a, an excellent recording and we were able to get to some good results. During your study, you were able to keep it on for about 405 minutes, so it was a nice thorough night. And overall, the sleep, you know, study indicates that you do have significant sleep apnea. We have what you call an apnea hypopnea index, or the number of apneas and hypopneas that you have per hour of sleep is 27, which would be considered a severe level of severity. I think also in REM sleep, or later on in the night, we saw more significant oxygen desaturations, and that is probably what's contributing to your headaches. With that level of severity and the tiredness you have during the day and sleepiness that you talk about, I want to recommend to you that we use a device which we call nasal continuous positive airway pressure, or commonly referred to as CPAP. Ms. Thompson, this is the CPAP machine that I spoke to you about. This is the blower. This is a humidifier. This is an auto titrating machine which will vary the pressure across the night based on your need. What we've added to this is a heated hose called Hibernite. And this is a very special addition that allow you to get the same level of humidity that we start here all the way to the mask so it's more comfortable to breathe. I'd like you to take the mask and put it up to your nose and take a nice smooth even breath in, smooth and easy, letting the air out. Notice how warm and comfortable the air is as you breathe easily and smoothly. Very good. All right, go ahead and take it down. By adding the heated hose of Hibernite, you're able now to get the kind of humidity I want you to have at the mask, and you will not get as congested, hopefully, and, and that way it'll be a much easier transition for you. Richard, uh, this is Dr. Spear calling. I have a patient in my office I'd like you to set up on CPAP. I want to make sure you add heated humidification and also the Hibernite hose. Hibernite? Absolutely. We've got plenty of it in stock. Hi, Richard Webb, Monitor Medical. Nice to meet you. Please step this way. I'd like to show you a variety of the masks that we have here at Monitor Medical. All types of masks. We have full face masks that fit over the nose and the mouth. We have nasal masks that are small triangular that just fit over your nose. And a third type is called a pillow style mask that gently seats right at each of the openings of your nostrils. So if you're ready, we'll go set up your CPAP machine. Come this way, please. You come on in here, Ms. Thompson, and this is your technician, Cherise. Hi, I'm Cherise. Nice to meet you. Would you like to join me? I'm going to pull this pink strap back, pull these down a little bit. How does that feel? Excuse me. I'm going to go ahead and hook your tubing up to your mask and turn your machine on. Would you like to try this one? Great. You know, heated wire tubing like the Hibernite can be put on a new person, a new patient who's never had CPAP therapy before. And it's also very beneficial to add to some of the older style heated humidifiers. In fact, some of the old heated humidifiers didn't work as effective as they are today. And so the heat and humidity is uh, much more consistent, much more beneficial, and uh, reduces the incidence of rain out in the tubing. It's a good question because those are two of the things you oftentimes experience with patients right out of the box, if you will. First of all, you have to make sure that the pressure that you have set is, is optimal. The other thing is you have to make sure that they're getting a comfortable flow of air, and that usually means humidification. And we have added humidification to our positive air pressure devices over time with a heated humidifier. Now we have access to a heated hose. And one thing about Hypernite that I really like is that it can go on any standard CPAP device. In other words, it's kind of a universal hose that allows anybody that has a standard CPAP machine to add heated humidification, which allows me then to add that additional treatment modality that improves their adherence and the efficacy of treatment. 
So when they get dry mouth and they're breathing through their mouth or their nose is congested, it's usually solved by more humidification, not less. And the only way I've been able to do that is with a heated hose in addition to the heated humidifier.